Hey, good morning. Old Tommy here, coming at you from the Starvation Plantation. Well, again, uh, I find myself this morning still trying to get this garage moved back here. Had some guys gonna show up to help me do it yesterday, but uh, this guy that's trying to do it, he's pretty good, but he couldn't get, he couldn't get any help. He said his help went fishing. <laughs> Can't blame him. Okay, this is what I didn't show you yesterday, or other day when I was hauling this. But uh, I had a chain tie from here to here. And I didn't use these the other day because it was flat. But now I'm going to go down a rope there and I got to get between that tree and that fence. But I got that's going to help get it started. Tied that chain between here and keep the chain from slipping. Going through these loops here and here. Tied that the ball. That way the chain can't go this way. That and my help. Now I'm going to try to pull this down here. Keep this going a little bit, get it kind of start rolling up on that. I'm gonna roll a little bit, and I got some more of those. I'm gonna pull a little bit when I get closer. So I'm afraid those things are gonna dig in where these roots are. So as I keep going, I'm gonna roll up a little bit at a time, and I'm gonna keep putting. I got six of those logs. We'll get about three of those going on each side. We're gonna do it Egyptian style. Work like an Egyptian. I move the ladder. Me up. I got a pair of this solution. Alright, here's what I'm dealing with now. Now, obviously, this bill on the way. I gotta get this over that way enough to come in while I straighten this up. I'm gonna move this camper out. I'm gonna back this Jeep back around here. Latch onto this rascal. I'm gonna see if I can rotate it this way and then get it in. Okay, next phase. Try to move the camper. Hope I have to call a wrecker. <laughs> well, it ain't being me, bro. Hold on tight. Here we go. All that, that away, Jeep hooked up to it. Get where I can clear that post right there.
that lever. Okay, I got it pulled over enough now. I'm gonna get back in here, get this Jeep. I actually had another chain over there so I didn't have to unhook my chain. I'm gonna manipulate this. What I'm going to try to do now is move this over. I'm going to try to do it just by levering it, try to get it lined up. I moved the chain back from the end to one of those second ones because I was about to run my Jeep was about to run off that drop off so I backed back and uh, try to just pull it up a little bit more. Back, back to the middle. Got a couple of rollers under there. I'm gonna try to pull it up one more time, and this will be the last time I'll be able to do it that way. So let's see what happens. bit further. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the rollers back under and I'm gonna take the front of my Jeep and I'm just gonna push it up under there. So we'll see how that goes. Stay tuned.
All right, now, for better or for worse, turn it just a little bit, and it is exactly where it needs to be. I'm gonna pin that side down. I'm gonna pin that side down and then brace it against some post. Then I'm gonna try to straighten that up right there. That's the next step. All right, we did move it down here. How did we do it? Just like an Egyptian. Nothing but the pyramids, huh? <laughs> <laughs>